What's up YouTube? This is Cobra Timmy and I'm here to present you with episode number four of In the Wild Finds. Episode number four has three pickups from three different stores. One Goodwill pickup, one Salvation Army pickup, and one Half Price Books pickup. So let's get started. Uh, first pickup is going to be the Salvation Army portion. I'm still on the hunt to finish the combination of my Atari 5200. So I picked this up. Uh, I don't know the price that I paid for this. I believe I paid $2.99 for this. But I picked it up because I'd never seen one like out in the wild before. And I didn't know if I'd ever come up with this. I have the console. I don't have any controllers or power box or anything. So I needed everything. So I picked this up on an instant. So I paid $2.99 plus tax. So it was probably like $3.24 or something like that. That's usually the normal price for $2.99 stuff. But there's that. So now I have the switch box and the console. So I need controllers and a uh, power adapter. Uh, next pickup was from Goodwill. Got four items here at a dollar ninety nine each. So, and with a donation, I paid nine dollars. The four items that I got were all original Xbox games, as you will see here. First one is Wallace and Gromit: The Curse of the Were Rabbit. And it comes complete. Should actually put the switch box up there. Uh, next is Hulk. And that is complete. And I'm not showing these in any specific order, so I don't know which one's worth more or not. Again, some of these games I'll just pick up because I don't have them in my collection. Uh, next pickup is. Prince of Persia, The Two Thrones. And that is complete as well. Then finally, the last pickup that I got, which looks kind of cheesy but interesting in the same way. Uh, Dinotopia, The Sunstone Odyssey. I thought this would be worth some money, but it's not. I think it's really a cheap game. So, but... I don't really see it anywhere. It only has the disc and the cover art, so there's no manual. So I might still try it out anyways for the heck of it. I mean, of course I'm going to try it because it's in my collection. That's a no-brainer. But um, the last pickup is from Half Price Books, as I said. Got three items, paid $8.66. It seems like it focuses better with my hand behind it, so I'm going to have to start doing that. Uh, the pickups here, if you haven't seen it already from it flapping up and down, as this bag has been just flapping everywhere, got the PlayStation 2 Grand Theft Auto uh, double pack. So it has Liberty City Stories and Vice City Stories. I believe I have one of these already. I got it for a birthday present or something, but I didn't have the combo. And the, this combo goes for like 10 20 bucks. When I looked it up at the time, I don't know if it still does, but for $2 I picked it up. And then I got two strategy guides for 3 bucks each. First one is Devil May Cry. And then the last one is Ico. Or Ico, however you say it. But short video here. That'll do it for episode number four of In the Wild Finds. Slim pickings, but, you know, hey, sometimes you have lots of finds and sometimes you don't. Stay tuned for the next video, and have a good day, peace out, and happy hunting.